racers from the era in which you grew up, the, the dirt racing pre-Indy 500 portion of your career, all speak with a certain awe about Langhorn. They have a kind of respect for the place that's reserved for the survivors. Is it true that you once tried to do turn one flat out at Langhorn? Well, uh, I it was definitely a part of uh, what my thinking process and uh, and the guy that actually probably saved my life is Tommy Hinnerschitz, who was you know one of the best sprint car drivers of the era, uh, who was my crew chief of all people, and he saw what I was he, he saw in me that there was a lot of fire, and I figured Langhorn could be the wrong place to really have that burning so long. And, uh, and especially going out to qualify, he told me, no matter how good it feels, when you reach a certain point, he told me, you know, like a pole and the lightness and that, back off, you know, set yourself up. I wouldn't have, you know. And uh, so I'm forever thankful to him because uh, Langhorn is one place that, uh, and that was my very first dirt championship dirt race. And um, uh, the night before is the only race probably in my entire career that I really didn't sleep the night before because I didn't know what to expect. Obviously, you don't get a chance to test or anything. And you go in there cold turkey and you're either in or out. And, uh, and I, again, you know, I was really, really concerned. It was, to me, it was like going to war, going to battle and figure, I hope I come back. <laughs> you know, it was that kind of a feeling. I, I never had that feeling since, which was good. The Dave Despain Show, presented by Carlisle Tools, Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern and Pacific, only on MAV-TV.